Hello, it's Flo for Hack2Com. Today I will show you how to save your HTC One S settings and your phone if you want to test a new custom ROM and uh, save all your things on your phone to to take care about uh, about uh, don't do a thing you, you you will regret later. So first thing is to go to settings. Here you can go to developer option and uh, uncheck USB debugging mode and you must be to power uh, and uncheck fast, fast boot debugging mode is nothing sorry just uh, just uncheck face fast boot here then you can power off your phone so let's go to power off your phone one thing could be great is to save your SMS with SMS backup and restore um, because if you test a new ROM custom and you will save SMS um, you will not save it in uh, Android backup so when your phone is turned off uh, you must wait a uh, few seconds because because sometimes it's it's not uh, totally totally power off so you can press volume down and at the same time power then unpress power and continue to press power down and your phone will start in recovery mode okay so it starts in bootloader mode and you must go to recovery by volume down and power to select it okay so uh, there is a power bar and your phone is starting in recovery mode okay so now you can go to backup and restore here and you must press backup then your phone is backup all the system okay and you must wait then it's finished Okay, so I have cut the video because it could take a time, and uh, you don't need to 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 see all the things. So um, to do that, you you must have um, root your phone, and you must have installed the recovery. Uh, then you can do the Android backup. At the end of this video, I will show you how to um, uh, how to restore. Uh, an Android backup. So here the backup is complete. You can see it here. Okay, so backup complete, and then you can install a custom ROM. To restore this backup, you just have to go to backup and restore. Then you can choose to restore or advanced restore. On advanced restore, you have all your backup here, and you can choose to restore only boot, system, data cache or sdx so you can do that and here okay so now i will show you how to install a rom custom in my new video thanks to have seen this one